Great. First things first, um, inflation numbers out. Traders reported seeing yields rising as investors uh, anticipated a rise in inflation numbers for June. Uh, of course, uh, the numbers are out. We're seeing a rise of about 12.9%. How did the market uh, respond to this announcement, Eze? Well, um, um, interesting. Uh, the, actually, the market actually did a mix of uh, a, a rise um, as flat, flat basis, and some actually dipping it across the across the curve. Um, not uh, much um, information can be garnered from the um, price action today, but we could say that perhaps the expectation of inflation has already been taken into the current prices that we're having today. Hence, the little or no um, 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 varied reaction to the inflation figure so far. Not undermining the fact that uh, the inflation figure was is um, akin to what was seen like two months back. Um, after the uh, slight dip for last month, you've seen another rise to 12.9%, uh, which is the uh, prior, prior inflation figure. So really, it's more like, uh, I think traders are trying to assess and gain more ground on what kind of positioning to actually um, ride on the back of this um, um, fixing, but not uh, undermining the fact that for next week, you'll have the MPC co uh, meeting coming up, and um, we'll want to see what clear direction will be inferred from these uh, uh, latest rise in inflation figures. Um, well, overall, let's, let's market sentiment. Well, let's shift our attention to the currency, as a uh, We saw the yeah. Naira remain slightly stable, gained slightly against the dollar there today. However, we're also seeing the CBN offering and selling $300 million at the WDAS auction. Now, it's obviously consistently increased the amount it, it, it was selling in the past week. We saw last week it sold about $180 million uh, on Wednesday. Uh, Monday, it sold about $200 million. Today, we're seeing it selling about $300 million today. Uh, now, are we seeing demand uh, for the dollar increasing of course in tell me give me a sense of what you feel this means for our currency you are obviously there's been an uptick uh, in demand um, well I wouldn't really say it's so much uh, significant it's more on the on the back of the fact that um, the flows that are coming to the market have actually slowed down a bit. So in terms of the fa um, alternate flow outside of the CBN window has tended to slow down and obviously the, fl uh, the demand tends to move back into the CBN window. That's what we've seen so far. Um, uh, so on the on the average, like you say, on the if I look at the, on the average basis, this uh, volume has not been outside of what CBN has done in the recent past. Um, so I think CBN overall is trying to still continue with the message that they're sending to say that at any point in time we are here and we have the capacity to meet whatever demand that would come. I will be, ought to be filled through our window. I think that's the message that are trying to project that they are projecting, and I think they've done that successfully, responding to whatever appropriate, whatever demand pressure that might emanate in in the course of the period.